गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू चैप्टर वन नोइंग अवर नंबर ऑफ क्लास सिक्स दिस इज दिन पार्ट ऑफ द वीडियो नाउ वी आर टूडे अवर टॉपिक इज रोमन न्यूमरल्स नाउ रोमन न्यूमरल्स यू माइट हैव सीन रोमन न्यूमरल क्लॉक लाइक दिस दे आर वन टू थ्री फोर Five. They are written like this. So today we are going to learn Roman numerals. So let us begin. What are the symbols for Roman numeral? So here I will give us one. That is I. Five stands for V. Ten stands for X. Fifty stands for L. Hundred stands for C. Five hundred is B. One thousand is M. So these are the symbols related to Roman numerals. So here there are certain rules. So what are the rules? So you might have seen Roman numbers one, one, two, three. And four is written as I V. Why not four lines? So the rule number one is you can repeat only three times. Means a number in this category can be repeated only three times, not more than three times. So here I is written as three, but when we are writing one, two, three, four like this, it is wrong. So here, so four times you cannot write any of the characters. You cannot write. Four times continuous. Maximum you can repeat is three times only. Second rule. V L D are never subtracted. Now here, if you see four, whenever the number smaller number is written on the left the right hand side of a bigger number, that time it is subtraction. We add the rule here. Number. On the right, we are right. Smaller number on the right of bigger number are subtracted. And on left are and now here if you see smaller number on right of bigger number are subtracted and on left are added. For example, I write V I means it is on the left hand side. So that is why I add five plus one is equal to six. When it is on the left hand side, it is five minus one is equal to four. So Roman number. Whenever I write the numbers on the uh, left hand side, it is subtraction. On the right hand side, it is addition. Third one. V, L, and D are Never subtracted. 
means here we cannot write Vx which is equals to 5 only. 10 minus 5 is 5. So we cannot, we never write number Vx or Vn. For example, whenever we are writing 45, we cannot write 45 like this. Because V, L, D are never subtract. Suppose you want to write 450. So you cannot write L, D. L is 50. This is 500. 500 minus 50. You can never write numbers. So you always, you have to go to the line. So V, L, D are never subtract. Now we are going to write 1 to 50. So here i is 1, 2i, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6, 7, 8, i x 9 and 10. Now 11. x i is 11. x i i 12. x i i 13. x i v 14. The same process is repeated but only the thing is x is added to front. x v x V I X V I I X V I I I X I X It is 19 X X 20 Now 21 Same thing add one more X To the same X X X I I 22 X, X, three lines. 23. X, X, I, V. 24. X, X, I. X, X, V. 25. X, X, V, I. 26. X, X, V, I, I. 27. X, X, V, I, I, I. 28, X, X, I, X. 29, 30. So now we are writing 31. So X, 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 I, V, 31. X, X, X. 32 x x x 33 this is this is 34 x x x v 35 x x x v i 36 x x x V I I thirty seven X X X V I I thirty eight now similarly thirty nine then forty is written as X L fifty minus ten so this is forty again 41. Continue this process as X L I. 41 X L I I. 42 X L I I I. 43 X L I V. 44 X L V. 45 
XLVI 46 XLVI 47 XLVI 48 now XLIX stands as 49 now you know L stands as 50 so these are the numbers from 1 to 50 now here your home assignment will be right from 51 to 100 your home assignment is complete numbers from 51 to 100 this is your home assignment write 51 to 100 in roman numbers now i'll give you 51 is equal to li 61 is equal to lxi 71 is equal to lxxi 81 is equal to lxxxi 91 is equal to xci so this is 91 now there is one more rule for subtraction of xc now x can be subtracted from l and c only l and c only C can be subtracted from D and M only. I can be subtracted from V and X only. That means 1 can be subtracted from 5 and 10. 10 can be subtracted from 50 and 100 only. C can be subtracted from 500 and and thousand on. So this is the thing. One can be subtracted five and ten. Ten can be subtracted from fifty and hundred. C can be subtracted from hundred and thousand. So this is one more rule. So here based on that, I'm given you the hint to complete your home assignment. That's all for this week. For this chapter. Next chapter will be starting soon.